Hi everyone, it's Tammy and Katie. Yay! <laughs> so this is my daughter and I know that there were a lot of questions about her engagement story and what a better person to tell it than Katie mm -hmm. herself. So um, that's what this is going to be, her story yes. of her engagement and it is a really sweet story so I hope that you guys will stay tuned to hear. Okay, so um, the November of 2019, David's coming over for Thanksgiving and um, it's really special because the year before I went and celebrated Thanksgiving with his family so this year he was celebrating with my mom and my dad um, and he, he had already asked my dad and my mom's hand in marriage he already asked for their blessing yes. and um, my dad said yes and they talked for about two hours in the little room and he yeah, he like made it special and then um, he talked with you at Starbucks. And I said, no way. <laughs> and she said, yes. So I was excited. I gave him a big hug. Yeah. So I knew he had asked. So I knew it was coming. And David, he's so cute. He like, he always wants to tell me everything, but he kept this a secret. So that was good. Um... It was really hard to keep a secret. Should I? Is this a secret or not? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Should I say it? Okay. So, um, <laughs> so anyways, so Thanksgiving time is also the time that it's around my birthday. My birthday is November 29th, and he had planned for all of us to go to Cake Bake, and it was a day after Thanksgiving was my birthday. So. So it's Black Friday. It's also Black Friday. It's and a big day. Cake bake is... Um, oh my goodness. You walk in, you feel like you're 12 years old experiencing the best dream you could ever have in your entire life. Or any age. Like, honestly, you go in and it's like Paris. It's white and pink and sparkly, gorgeous, elegant. All of the, There's pastries. Everyone's dressed, like, really cute. With their little white thing, a little bow, and like a little... Bow apron. thing, apron, and um, they have like they're baking all these cakes. Yeah, and they make huge. these magnificent desserts. Yes. And then they serve tea. Yeah. And lemonade and iced tea, champagne, things like that. It's like very, it's like a very upscale bakery, but it's more than that because it's got it's like the experience. Yes, the experience is amazing. It's got little tables that you can sit at. Um, I think I did a video a few years back because um, Katie took me there for my birthday one year and we had tea and I had my very first macaroon. It's the one and only I've ever had and oh my gosh, it was so good. So, mm. I mean, just just yeah. knowing that you're going to cake bake is an exciting so experience. Fun. Yeah, you're like, oh. And so that morning we went Friday, Black Friday shopping because David loves to shop. Like, he is, he is so good at picking out clothes for me and for him. Like, he knows what fits me so well. It's ridiculous. And um, so we were shopping, and then uh, we were getting ready to go to Cake Bake because he also set up for there to be photographers because we've always wanted a couple pictures. And he's like, well, since we're doing your birthday at Cake Bake, that's the perfect venue to take pictures. And I'm like, yeah, that sounds great. Let's do it. And he invited my family to come to celebrate my birthday with us. I was turning 22. So it's not like a big deal. <laughs> I don't know. But um, I was getting ready, so excited. And we go and we're taking these cute pictures and they're like having us pose in different places. And then David's posing me. And I'm like, this is weird. Does, does he have like a picture in mind? I don't know. And he like poses me by the tree. And then... Because they have a Christmas tree set up in this. So there's a special room that they went into. Sorry. Yeah. I'm, no. So say. when you walked into Cake Bake, it's beautiful anyway. But then they have this room that people can rent. And David had rented it for the evening. And in the room, there's a beautiful fireplace with beautiful white and um, flocked greenery and... Uh, white fluffy stockings and a beautiful yeah. flocked green Christmas tree with beautiful lights and um, 
little uh, bulbs and everything matches so yeah, well. It was like, it was like and everything was white. Like it was just beautiful. It was really, really pretty. White and pink. And then, oh yes, that's right. And silver. Oh, and when I walked in, they gave me a sparkly rose, sparkly pink rose. Oh yeah. They're like, oh, it's your birthday, rose. And they like led us to the back room and you can like see the bakers and stuff doing their thing. And um, we had like our private room. We're taking pictures and this beautiful chandelier and we're like posing and stuff. And he has me posed by the Christmas tree. And he gets down and he pulls something under the tree and he's on one knee and he goes, the best gifts are found under the tree or something like that. The best presents are under the tree. And he pulls out the box and he opens it up and he's like, oh, oh yeah. He said my full name. I didn't know this until Aww. after. He was like, Caitlin Noel Lathan, will you marry me? Yeah. I'm like, yes, you're thinking about me. And then, um, you come in first. And little does she know that I am sit I'm standing in the waiting area, <laughs> like in the, there's like a little hallway before this little room and I'm talking with some of the staff and they are so excited because they know what's happening because David mm -hmm. had worked it out with them prior and so they knew what was happening and there was this one lady who I, cause of course I'm early because I'm early for everything <laughs> so we get there early and I have it's me and my husband Dennis and my son Alex and we're all standing there and we have gifts for them because it's her birthday and then because I knew that they were getting engaged I also had an engagement present for them and um, we're standing there watching and one of the women that's there she's like oh my gosh I'm so excited I'm so excited mm -hmm. we're like waiting and they're in there taking their pictures and they're kind of dancing a little bit and taking some pictures and he's throwing <laughs> her around and the lady's like oh my gosh when's it gonna happen when's it gonna happen and she I guess had to go to the restroom and she's like um oh, watch it's gonna happen while I'm in here and it did <laughs> I felt so bad for her. She was like, oh, man. But um, just as he was going down on one knee, there were people that were seated, like, in the hallway kind of a thing. Oh, they, no. like, stand up to get their coats on, and they're, like, all standing in front of the door, and I can't see. And I'm like, no. And then one of the other staff members goes, would you guys mind sitting down for just a minute? Her daughter's getting engaged right now. And then so they're all clapping, and they're happy. It was really sweet. So then, so we got to so see it. Boom. The doors open yeah. and they like start coming in. And they're like, yay. <laughs> it was so cool. It was very overwhelming. I loved it though. You were giving hugs. <laughs> yeah, and... giving so many hugs. And uh, David's uh, dad came. His mom was working. She's a doctor. and But his dad came. And um, Steve, his brother, came. And his fiance, Elena, they came and they're from St. Louis so that was like a long drive for them to come all the way just for this like night, I don't know, to celebrate with us. It was really special. Um, and then we all had um, my favorite cake. It's red velvet and it has little roses all around it. It's all sparkly and we had special drinks. They didn't have alcohol in them because we just didn't want to and um, but they were like sparkly. They were beautiful. They were like lavender lemonade. Yeah. Like and something else. Very fancy. Yes. The lavender lemonade is the one that we got, I think, isn't it? Yeah. So good. I loved it. With the cake. Oh, we had so much cake left over. <laughs> oh, and then after he's like, okay, Katie, I have to spend a minimum of however much. You have all of this money. Like, you can buy whatever you want in this place. So he, like, took me out. And I got, like, this really pretty snow globe. Oh, and I didn't a charm. Know that. And, Yeah. I didn't even know that. How cool is that? Yeah. I wonder if they even sold like teacups and stuff. You could have gotten something like that maybe. Well, I, got a, got I got a water bottle. Yeah. I got two charms, a water bottle, and a snow globe. I really wanted the snow globe. That is so awesome. Yeah. It's really cool. And the cake was phenomenal. phenomenal. And David was so cute. He, he so like, cool. afterward, he wanted to take me on. So he's allergic to horses, but he still wanted to take me on a horse and carriage ride. <laughs> so sweet. Did you? No, we like walked around for a long time trying to find one. It was really cold. Aww. But we did go to Starbucks and I got my free Starbucks drink. Oh, good. Yeah. Didn't even think to ask about that. He is so special. Like, he planned the whole thing out by himself. The photographer. Yeah, the photographer. The cake, cake, cake drinks, drinks, the menu. I mean, Inviting it was like, everyone. Yeah. Like, a lot great. of people came. Like, my dad, my, my dad, Angie, Courtney, Anwar. Spencer, so how do I explain it? 
Your dad and his fiance and then wife, whatever. They're getting married. They're next getting week. married next weekend. So. <laughs> Maybe when you see this, they will already be married. So yeah. her dad and his and her and Angie. His wife and her kids. <laughs> and her then kids and their Katie's kids. Katie's brother, yeah, brother and David's brother and his fiance and his yeah. dad. So it was great. Yeah. A lot of people. And the cake. They paid for everyone. The cake was beautiful. The cake um, at first said happy birthday or something on it. And then. No, it didn't. It oh, didn't. did it? Yeah, I think it did. And I then and then the little card, they turned it over they and it said it. she said yes. And they were holding it up. It said she said yes. It was really cute. Um, And. Oh, yeah. The menu was like really sparkly and pretty. I might have it. Hold on. I'll see if I have it. Okay. But yeah, it was so special. He did an amazing job. I was blown away. So excited. This is the ring. Maybe we can get a better shot of it uh, this time. I'm going to pick the camera up. I'm going to do this. So, I'll use my cheek. I like that the diamond's kind of like... There. So I did not, like he picked this ring by himself, but he did a really, really good job. Love it. Okay, I love it. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. That's good. Okay. So here is the menu. So this is, uh, there. I had more than one and this one is kind of a mess, but that's okay. I wanted to keep kind of a messy one just for my scrapbook if I wanted to cut it up or whatever. But I have a good one too, just so you know. I have one too. Okay. <laughs> so um, it says cake bake at the top and then congratulations Katie and David, November 29th, 2019. And then your choice of beverage and then the dessert. It's just he so did all it's of like this. sparkly paper. I don't know if you can see that, but and it even Isn't says red velvet He's cake. Amazing. Our red velvet cake is darker and richer than your typical cake. We chop sh calib calibo Belgium chocolate and fold it into French Valhona chocolate. Layers of red velvet cake. Well, um, our signature cream cheese frosting fills these three layers. Madagascan yeah. vanilla bean buttercream blankets the outside of the cake in a light pink rosette pattern. This beautiful presentation and exceptional flavor of our red velvet makes it a sensational gift or the perfect celebration. It was so good. How about that? So I mean, wow. I remember now, um, I wanted the confetti cake. <laughs> oh. Because he was like trying to decide what cake. He's like, what cake should we get for your birthday? I'm like, confetti cake. I love the confetti cake. So I was kind of curious why he did the red velvet because I, I love the red velvet one. But now it makes now it makes sense because it's like more romantic. With the little rosettes on it. Yeah, it's very, really, really, very pretty. And it was And he was so, so handsome. Good. He's always so handsome. I will definitely put some pictures of them. Like, he end. always knows. I'm never embarrassed by the way he dresses. Like, he always looks so good. And he looked like a snack. The full <laughs> meal deal. Yeah. <laughs> and Katie didn't look half bad herself. Mm -mm. He was just so nice. She's like, gorgeous. And he was so cute. He said he didn't even remember. Like, Aww. after he asked me, he's like, I don't even what. I don't even remember what I said. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet too that you had a photographer because then they can. They yeah, it's actually, like we got our engagement pictures. And there was a video too. Of yeah, the, the um, so uh, the photographer she went to Taylor University and then she went to IUPUI and her husband goes to Taylor University and is my fiance's brother's best friend. Yeah. Hard to explain. <laughs> I know, but um, anyways, he took the video, so that's really cool that we have a video and. Yeah. Yeah, and if you want to see the video... I can post it if you don't mind. No, I don't mind. Okay, I'll post it after this, and I'll put the video, and then I'll put some pictures, too. Yeah. And um, we think that the same photographer is going to be her wedding photographer, too, so that will be... Yeah, that would be nice, but it's so expensive. <laughs> oh, my gosh. But they're all expensive. I was talking to Tracy this morning. I, really? Uh -huh, and, she doesn't know any more than I know, but she was like, it sounds like it's reasonable and you guys already know him. She was making some good points. Yeah, she's true. doing this $500 off deal, but it's still like $1,700. Expensive And then we still would need a videographer. <laughs> it's just one day, you know? But it's the day. 
but it's just one day. There's that day, and then there's the day that your children are born. But, I mean, marriage is a thing that's like the, what we should be putting our effort towards. It's not, but I mean, we do need a video because we're doing a second reception in St. Louis. So, oh, that was something that they asked. They, someone asked um, if I'm gonna live here. Oh. If I'm gonna live close to you. But no, I'm gonna live in St. Louis. <laughs> Guess mama's gonna be moving to St. Louis. <laughs> But it's not that far, and no, they're actually not. doing direct flights now to St. Louis. Did you know that? Hmm. There's a new airline uh, through Indianapolis that's doing direct flights to local cities. I just drive, though. It's only four hours. Yeah, it's only four hours. I don't know why. Yeah. I mean, I could rent a car. That way I don't have to put miles on my car. I wish I, like I could rent anyway. a car. I know. You're just not old enough yet. He looks... 25, I think. David's going to be 25 when we get married. So he could rent a car. But he doesn't even need to rent a car. I'd need to rent a car. My car is way worse than his car. And he has a nice car. And my car can't make it to St. Louis. That's the point. <laughs> but. All right. But he visits me a lot. Yes, he does. He's sweet and she's sweet. Mm -hmm. So it is, right now it's um, February. I'm like, what month is it? She graduates in May. And then um, she's going to be a teacher. And then. Special ed. We Sorry. are going to. Or she is going to get married in July of next year. So 2021. We have a little bit of time, but I don't know when you guys are watching this, but we're really excited for her. Yeah. We are all blessed. Prayers. To have her in our life. Yes, prayers. that would be great. Yes. And comma what you want us to pray for you about. Yeah, we'd be happy to do that. And that's all. <laughs> so thank you for watching, and I hope you have a fabulous day. Enjoy today. Do something fun.